We accomplished what we set out for, and I think the trip was a success. And it did exactly what you want every adventure to do, and that is you get enough of a taste and have just enough fun to want to come back and do it a lot more. That's helpful. Good. Yes! We're back! What is up, MFers? Probably not surprised to see this guy, KCD, Six Sense president beside me, but you probably are surprised to see him where we're at. He's never been north ever before. Casey's talking about it. He's, he catches the big largemouth all the time, but he wants to head north and catch some freaking giant smallmouth. So we're gonna do it. I'm ready. We're gonna do it the next three days. We're going up, we're fishing some of the areas where you guys have seen us catch some absolute freaking giants. And we actually have one more guest, one of your favorite MFers joining us pretty quickly actually. We're gonna need to hurry. Casey's gonna scare the shit out of the Zark when he gets here. He's gonna hop in the boat. We're gonna prank him to get this trip started off right. And then late tonight, we're getting into our hotel. First thing in the morning, we are, uh, we're are we getting after the fish. We got kind of a long drive tonight. So we need to scare Zark to get things going and uh, we, we got just the thing to do it. So I've been telling Zark the last week, um, Zark's like, by the way, like the biggest Sixth Sense fan of all time. Like giant, giant Sixth Sense fishing fan. Never met Casey before. And I told him I have a special guest coming. And so Cole that's running the camera, I'm gonna say it's Cole is a special guest. It's actually Casey, obviously. Uh, he has no idea that Casey's gonna be here. I'm gonna get his him. mask. And I'm so gonna we're, we're gonna be like, Zark, put your rods in right here. He's gonna be here any minute though. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be a good time. Hopefully we can make it work. <laughs> where's your stogie? It doesn't even match. Sorry. And where's your wizard hat? Even more important. What's up? Cole's a fan too. Is it? You gotta go. Get your mouth. Cole, get your cover off. We're fishing. You take the cover off. We got the cover loose and just pull it up. I don't want to have to hurt you right away. My favorite rod. Which is 7.4 medium heavy? 7.4 medium heavy. I will kiss you on the mouth. To Ben, <laughs> not to me, right? To Ben. How's it going? Hey, not bad, man. You got no trailer blanks. Really? Yeah, and you're going 75. What? <laughs> we got a warning because he's a fisherman. He gave us some spots to hit. Really? My man. But what about the lights? I just fixed them. I wiggled them and okay, they went back. Good. <laughs> yeah, they're good now. Okay, just got the boat launched, made out to the first spot. I'm freaking jacked. Casey's first time ever chasing a big smallmouth. We're at the place to do it. Now it's time to drop the hampers, I guess. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. fish of the trip, it's 20 bucks. That's a good one. You can catch one under three pounds. You can't tell, man. He's not that big. I've barely seen one that small. Good job, Zarb. Got a baby. He's junk, though. Wait, what, what'd you catch that first fish on? What is that? That, I don't even know the name of it. What is the name of that going to be, Casey? The prawn on a swing head. That's cool, dude. That's the first ever fish on the prawn officially. So, really? Yeah. Sweet. Smalley. 
Nice little cup of powder. Healthy yeah, that one's fat. That's a fish. Got one. <laughs> This in the pre spawn. Jesus, dude. I was gonna tell you last night, Casey, I'm like, oh, these ones don't fight like smallmouth. They're, uh, they fight a lot slower in the kitten, but that was just pre spawn apparently. These ones are out of their damn mind in the summer. Yep, anywhere to the left. I seriously might need a net for this one. Yeah, it's, it's big. I haven't seen him yet. I wish there was someone else in the boat that could get the net for me. How do I use this turns thing? Turns out I'm by myself. Ooh. Oh, that's a <laughs> that, that is a football. Good God. Yes! <laughs> We're back! <laughs> back! Oh God, look how bug out he is. Barely in there, too. Look, that's like a 19, 18 half 19 inch fish, probably. How much does that weigh? Dude, oh, they're so tough short. to tell how big they are. Joe's yeah. got a good. About this brand new scale, and it's nice. It's a little bigger, though. It's pretty small and clean. I'm just messing with this. <laughs> Alright, first fish of the trip. Hold on. Ready? No. No. Ready? Yeah. No. Five point one six. That is a girthy mama. That's a dirty shrimp eater right there. That's how we're gonna start things off. Because I fish this, I don't fish it like most people do with the jig head in it, which makes it spiral and stuff. I'm dragging on the bottom. All I want is something that's natural but sits so up off the bottom. I want it to has float. A few tentacles. Has a few tentacles because I do better on this when I rip off about half. It's of kind of a combo. Tube, Edward, and Craw, anything. It looks a lot like a natural soft bait on the bottom. Alright, Timmy's, we're going up to a rock point. Struck it! Dang! him when I was here last time. Oh Dude, my god, look, look at, at that the fish. size. Here, get a shot get of me stepping eating, on it. <laughs> that look at how wide that thing is. That's a freaking tank. Swing head, rock pile. We got a serious chance of catching the state record once again. We didn't think so. We thought they'd be leaned out in the summer. Look how that thing's built. I don't think they have a summer build. I think it's just pre spawn all year. Yeah. It's still spawning. So what you get that guy out? The prawn. That, that's Swing not head. even a prototype. That's going into production. It's in one. production now. Yeah. That's Be here in uh, December. Be December. Here in December, MFers. <laughs> Netfish? I don't know. They're all netfish. Oh. Yeah, we better net that one. Oh, ho, ho, ho. 
that oh. works as well. <laughs> God, that one's the same size. Das Prof. Look how fat that fish is. Ah, oh, God, you can't even it's get them, like man. Prawn, right? And it's It's a fun bite though when you're punching it. Huh? It's a pain in the ass flipping stuff to like this that kind of sporadic and grows out. But when you get on a good punching bite, that's fun. I love that. But it's also a pain in the ass. You lose a ton of them. That's frustrating. Smallmouth eat black and blue. They will. But don't throw it. Usually we throw natural stuff though. They like the straight black sometimes. That's a dead gator right there. Big gators up here. Eat the pikes. Oh, right at the boat. Oh! Whew. They're going smally. Damn. On the glow bait. Shoot. <laughs> Throwing a spinner. <laughs> God dang. Just out of the corner of my eye and stopped my spinner bait and he just swiped it. Can we didn't get hooked. Let's uh let's buzz up to this bank right up here and do the same thing real quick. It's got a lot better shit. It's got grass and timber. Fish? Yeah! He's got one! <laughs> it's a big one. Boom! <laughs> Did it! Oh, yeah. That's a BB. All right. Huh? Yeah, hell yeah, it is. <laughs> Absolutely. I'm You're the greatest fisherman alive! <laughs> We're eating that one. Play him up. For real? No. <laughs> That's a good. Hey. Good one. Flipping. Alright, let's let's release this guy. Flipping grass Biggest with the new prawn. Absolutely. Yeah. Hey, look at this guy too. We caught this is like the one of the only baits we've caught him on. Swing head and ways, punching. It's a long ways to come for that fish. It is. Let's catch 37 more. Alright, I put us over the 20 pound mark. Wow, two bites in like 30 seconds. Three bites in 30 seconds. I think that was the same one. What the hell did you catch? Is that an alligator again, Joe? That's a gator. It's a gator. What is that? Is that a smolly? Smolly yes, frog! Never give up! That's a big one. Oh, <laughs> That's the best thing ever. <laughs> Think that was the same one? I don't know. Oh. Look at that froggy. <laughs> that's a that's a big yeah, smolly on a frog, dude. That is awesome. I bet no one's ever documented a smolly that big on a frog before. Ever. That's incredible, man. How big is that one? Four and a half? Four? Yeah, probably. Four? That is incredible. numbers wise of course the quality has been really really solid but we just pulled up to some grass mats of course Casey's around the boat now the the Texas boy said we got to go punch some some heavy grass and he, Casey's an offshore dragger but he's done a fair share of flipping and frogging as well we get up shallow here in a defined grass mat defined edge we're fishing deeper it's like eight to ten feet off this edge and Casey hits a big one Joe gets two big blubs on a frog smallmouth are doing that I missed one this is basically what we're doing we're, we're flipping this prawn creature bait. We're going to go out, we're going to do some more dragging because we think it's kind of a timing deal where the fish just need to reload. But this is a fun way to catch them. It's like doing something we've never done before, but we do all the time. We're catching smallmouth punching and frogging. Definitely something we're going to have to expand on a little bit more and probably do throughout the weekend at some other lakes as well because the water's high and there's tons of grass everywhere. But uh, yeah, we're just going to keep on fishing around. We've got several hours left here at the lake. We, we've got over a 20 pound limit of smallmouth. Can't ever complain about that, but they're giant right now. They're very, very well fed. I'm gonna give a giant. Maybe. What is it? I'm getting under you there, Cole.
little different when it comes out. It's going to have black handle and it's going to be full handle. Really? Okay. So I can have this one. Hey! <laughs> oh, <laughs> <about to> make <laughs> it. Seven four medium heavy. Seven four medium heavy. I will kiss you on the mouth. To Ben, <laughs> not to me, right? <laughs> to Ben. It says Dude, I love it. <laughs> That's the greatest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Those are coming in the series. Uh uh. That's the Zark. Yeah. Is that a fish? No, it's not. Oh. Seven four heavy. Dude, that is awesome. I think I got 20 pounds myself. Whatever, Joe. Why does it, why does it taste like that? I don't know. Who does that? <laughs> Who talks about I catching fish? I fish, Joe. <laughs> Me too. It's been a day. They're just getting warmed up, though. We got them figured out. Now we're staying until midnight. Yes, sir. Drop shot warm. Double drop shot and thing, guy. All right, which one's it on? <laughs> My boat is two. Right, dude. It's a He got pissed when he seen the boat. Snatcher. It's a dad gun prawn snatcher. It's about a half pound or so. Jesus. I mean, 
Dude, that was like flipping in a six pounder in, in back home. That was a big one. God. Okay. Apple Maps. Don't ever trust Apple Maps, guys. Stop because, the car. Uh, Seriously. <laughs> Stop the car. Well, there was a little down road. I saw that. I don't think that's where we wanted to be. No, it is. I'm just glad they. This isn't shaky yacht oh, this video is quality, money. is it? Oh, we just took the shortcut, is all. We're good. Alright, we're Maybe. Way now. <laughs> Oh, oh. someone's gonna have to move, there. aren't they? Had a good night last night uh, here at the Hidden Hill Lodge. We're in the middle of freaking nowhere. That's where we're staying the next couple <laughs> nights. Um, I I don't know. It seemed like a disappointing day on the water to an extent, but we had like a 26 pound limit. We just get so spoiled when we go to that lake and catch like, I don't know, 20 to 30 or 44 plus pounders the last few times we went there. This time we went there and caught like six or seven, but they were big ones, really big ones. Zark laid the freaking hammer, the staff, the wizard staff with this brand new, I don't know if you guys caught that, but we're actually, we're coming out with a Zark special. If you guys watched the video, you'll know that he is a really good meticulous dragger of, of baits and a swim jigger. That rod's gonna be perfect for both. So, What's your man? You excited for your ride? I'm excited. It was the greatest. It was the highlight of my day for sure. Over, oh. even over the small man. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're, we're about to head out to a, a new lake, trying to get out of here this morning. We need to get this guy right here, a big donkey one. sore. He lost a big one hunching for smallmouth. Weirdest thing I've ever seen in my life, but it fits. There, there's crawdads in the grass. We punched through there and we got bit. The biggest thing I think for us was we caught almost every single fish on this new prototype bait called the prawn. It's like a beaver craw style bait, super natural looking bait, like no action, very, very subtle. And it's like the only thing that they freaking want to think is going to be a bat some bitch when we get it out. So after that one. December? December. All right. Well, we'll take you guys out right here at the lodge. We're heading out to the lake, Better Lake. I hope. Catch you guys soon.